A 3 0 win against Needham Market meant that Hitchin Town were invited to Clarence Park in the second qualifying round of the Emirates FA Cup. Only uh, some club media officials and executives are allowed to attend, and well, we fit the bill for that, don't we, Mara? We did, yeah. I mean, it was masks on at all times, and, and watch your social distancing, but yeah, very privileged to have been there in this FA Cup uh, challenge. There's a familiar face and goal for St Albans, the former Canaries goalie Michael Johnson. Good to see him on the Saturday. Uh, here's St Albans then, get things underway uh, at Clarence Park. It was, a, it was a chilly afternoon despite the sunshine and Laurie Marsh clears one away for the Canaries. But St Albans moving it forward well uh, with Banton gets into the box and the shot goes wide. Has it, has it gone wide? Oh, it's gone into the side netting, in. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Very close to St Albans come forward again. Chance for them. It's fallen yeah. to Jeffers in the middle. He beats the goalkeeper. He somehow got there ahead of Wolster and Edie finds the bottom corner. But that's sheer determination, oh. isn't it? He's just he wants the ball. He wants it. Look at him. You can see the man coming from far. Look at that. Bang. And uh, yeah. <laughs> He's got a good shot on him. So St Albans have the lead then against the Canaries who move it wide uh, to Rio de Silva. Gets around Bender, comes in onto his left foot. Good. Now checks on his right, deflected wide in the end uh, by McKenna. Uh, and it's wide of Michael Johnson's goal. But here uh, is Jeffers again. Jeffers, oh, it's moved through the middle well. And Ryan's brought down Warner Ellie in the middle. Good. Surely a penalty, it definitely is. What colour yeah, is the right. card? It is a red card for That's Max Ryan. And, and well get off Max Ryan I mean what, I don't know what you think you're doing you know I mean come on look at that it's absolutely no way he's going to get away with that one and Ryan uh, walks down the tunnel only 10 minutes in time for Jeffers makes it two it's a lovely penalty yeah. beats Tin and Parker who went the wrong way St Albans then with a two goal cushion yeah, that man Jeffers there that name rings a bell doesn't it for Gooners Francis Jeffers yeah uh, well, maybe a relation, who knows, is Callistead onto his right foot. Ooh. Why did the mark? He is the danger man. He is. He is. I mean, it, <laughs> it seems that we're coming alive now a, a little bit. Teams do often play better with only 10 men as the ball scoops over the top. And that will be half time at Clarence Park. It's 2 0 uh, to Sin Albans. Disappointing half of the Canaries, but they showed signs of intent. Yeah, they did. And uh, like I say, I, I don't want to put all the bonus on one man, but it, it is. Max Ryan's red card costing itch. And so far, Brown gets the shot away. Never right. really going to challenge Johnson. Yeah, no, he's, he's got better than that. Sin Albans going forward to chip over Ooh. Parker. He'll be a relieved man in between the hitch and sticks. Caught a couple of times. Just wandering off his line. Hitch can get away with that one. His stead. Great work by him. Brown yes, brought Brown down. Yeah. Penalty. Absolutely. No. The referee waves away the Canaries appeals. Johnson will tell Johnson Brown what he thinks of that. that. Watch this, right? As he comes in. Look, there you go. Eddie Riley's GoPro footage has caught Michael Johnson red-handed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, you're nicked. Hitching going forward again is Callum Stead. Really good work onto Callum. his right. Hits the post. Oh. What a chance of the Canaries. And nothing comes of it in the end. Hitching a hammering on the door. But it's remaining firmly locked shut. Here's St Albans coming forward again. Jeffers, the two goal man. Moving it forward well. Needs to be dealt with this. Ben Wolster, can he kick it out? No. It's chipped oh. over Parker. And St Albans have three. That is very tough for Hitching to come back with this. Defensive errors, you know, it's, it's no good there for the Canaries. It's not good enough. St Albans coming forward again down that left hand side. And uh, once again, you can Before make again, uh, make the comments that was where Ryan really oh should no. have been in this second half. Ball down the right, crossed in. I think it's come off Kai Teal. It's trickled over the goal line. How unfortunate is that? Yeah, I've got to feel sorry for Kai Teal there, really. He's only just come on, and he, poor boy. Here's Laurie Marsh. Marsh doesn't really clear. It's one back by Harpenden. Uh, St Albans, sorry, in that left-hand side. Ball swung across, that's and it's an easy go. finish. No, really well goal. taken, though. Zane Banton, what a cross as well. Yeah, superb cross, superb goal. It's just a sweet move all round, and... Uh, you know, you don't mind them goals, do you? Because they're quality. St Albans, maybe one last chance. Then move back to the edge of the box. And that's over yellow. into Clarence Park. 
uh, reminder that we have done little updates on this and we've made a podcast all about this game uh, which is available on all podcast platforms just search for the Canary Club podcast it's full time at Clarence Park it's in Auburn City 5 Hitchin Town 0 Hitchin are out of the Emirates FA Cup Hitchin 0 a big 